A recent question from uh, the spouse of a female practitioner was that he felt his wife's team were completely out of control. The practice was uh, uh, not doing well. The team members called the shots. His wife was very concerned about the patients, about the business, and very fearful that some of her employees might leave the practice. And she had actually become very close friends with her team, which gave them more or less an upper hand and allowed them to think it think of it as it's our practice. And while we want the team to have an our practice attitude, we certainly never want any dentist to uh, lose control of his or her practice. So my advice to this young man was that the first order is his wife must become the practice leader. And leadership skills are just like any other skills. They truly have to be developed. They're not, you're not born with leadership skills as a rule, but they can certainly be developed. Uh, starting with a job description and outlining the doctor's expectations of each and every team member and uh, uh, letting the team know that uh, you are extremely valuable to the practice, but beginning March the 1st, uh, July 1st, these are going to new, be new, our new practice guidelines, and we are going to uh, put me back in the driver's seat. I think that a lot of young female dentists often become very friendly and chummy with their employees, and while I really believe that it's nice to be close to your team, uh, you can actually lose control and they can uh, take the upper hand. So in this particular practice, I would highly recommend that this doctor develop her leadership skills and to more quickly do that, she probably could benefit by bringing in a management consultant who deals with leadership and uh, staffing issues. And uh, if she's fearful that these people may leave the practice, once the new guidelines are outlined and her expectations are clearly stated and uh, there's a chance that she may lose one or more of these employees, but frankly, it's a lot easier to start new guidelines and new policies with new attitudes. So if they're not willing to make the change, she will not be losing uh, an asset. She will be cutting anchors and moving forward.